generation stressed. All were uh, diving into the biggest stressors for each generation all this week. This morning, we're focusing on Gen Z, those born during or after 1996. If you think about homework, sports, practice, family stresses, well, you think that's the, it, the stresses, you are wrong. Nine News reporter John Glasgow looked into the research on all this, and he found out that gun violence causes the most stress, which I guess shouldn't be too surprising. That's right, Gary. 75% polled by the American Psychological Association said that mass shootings top the list when it comes to their stressors. In the United States, more than 300 mass shootings took place in 2018. Now, a mass shooting is generally defined as four or more people shot. The gunmen, they targeted high schools, synagogues, bars, even a newspaper last year. We sat down with students at Alameda Junior Senior High School. Here's what they had to say about the thought that's always there. Uh, it's kind of nerve wracking, you know, because I never know if it's going to happen. I wish it wasn't the case that we, we have to be uh, aware of that. Like you never know when it could happen or where you could be and you never know like who the shooter could be or anything. It's kind of sad that people like especially younger kids go through that and have to worry about something so serious at a young age. Whenever we have like a lockdown or um, a lockout, it's you're kind of like always like, oh, is there somebody in here? Do they have a gun? And we're supposed to lock the doors, turn off the lights, and go into a corner where you're out of sight. Um, everybody's quiet, locked doors. You have a guard up. Because I know it is very possible that it would happen. Knowing that at any moment, this is something that, that lives around us, so it is a scary thought. Yeah, definitely. And the principal at Alameda Junior Senior High says that a lockdown drill is held every semester. That's where the students and staff practice procedure for a dangerous situation inside the school. She says safety comes first before education. You can see all of our content, Gary and Corey on 9news.com. I agree with that girl. It is so sad. John, I think thank about you. that.